Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at FastCompany.com, and they're talking about tree planting drones in Myanmar, uh, formerly known as Burma, and I'm sure I'm mispronouncing Myanmar, but it's a small country in Asia, a lot of coastline, a lot of river coast as well, and they deforested a lot of their mangrove trees. Mangroves grow right pretty much in the water, right near the water's edge. Their roots just form these intricate webs it's a great environment for fish they sequester a lot of carbon as well and uh, really they they were deforested for to make room for rice fields and fisheries and that sort of thing so now they're trying to plant a whole lot of them and they came up with this technology that shoots these little seed pods into the ground that develop into full trees. They believe they're going to use local labor to fill up the seed pods and get them ready. They have nutrients in them as well, tailored to the species of tree they're looking for. They want to combine this uh, mangrove forest planting with agroforestry so locals can have other crops to make money on rather than cutting down the mangrove trees to sell for fuel or lumber. Now, they say it can plant 100,000 seeds in a day with a team of six drones. You have the planting drones that shoot these little seed pods in the ground, I assume with a compressed air. And then you have survey drones that first map out the area and try and find the best locations to plant these seeds so you don't end up wasting seeds and putting them on top of rocks or whatnot. They say it can do it about 10 times faster than human planters and half the cost. That could be a great way to plant massive amounts of trees. Lumber companies could use this. They could use it for that green, great green wall of Africa that they're trying to plant right up the middle of Africa near the northern desert there, the Sahara. That could, there's a lot of applications this could be used. Maybe even farmers, permaculture farmers, guerrilla gardeners get one of these and start planting trees randomly in all sorts of places. Of course, finding the seeds is a problem, but they think they're going to use locals to find the seeds as well as they have been doing so far. There's a lot more information in this article than I can go over in this short video. So if you want to read more about it, I will link to it in the description. And if you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.